Chefs and head cooks oversee the daily food preparation at restaurants and other places where food is served. Chefs and head cooks work in restaurants, hotels, private households, and other food service establishments. Although post-secondary education is not required for chefs and head cooks, many attend programs at community colleges, technical schools, culinary arts schools, and four-year colleges. They check the freshness of food and ingredients, develop recipes, determine how to present dishes, monitor sanitation practices, and follow kitchen safety standards. Chefs need to have a sense of taste and smell, creativity, and leadership skills. Being a chef is rewarding in so many ways. The thing I find most rewarding about my work is the joy on somebody's face after they eat something. So I spend my day and the days prior uh, thinking and creating, let's say, a beautiful plate of dessert. And then I spend the entire day prepping it, getting everything ready for it, and then it goes into the restaurant. We You order it, we plate it up, and then to see your face or to hear about how much you enjoyed it is the most rewarding thing. When people go out to eat, it's definitely um, an enjoyable experience, and I enjoy giving them that experience. I get to come to work with all of these ideas in my head and you know, put them to life. Pastry is extremely exact. Like you have to understand the science behind it. There's a lot of chemistry involved and it it is precise, which is my nature. And I think that that just my, mm, my pursuit of perfection maybe lent myself, my capabilities more to be a pastry chef because you still get to create and you're still artistic, but you get to be really controlling and exact at the same time. When I was younger, I just enjoyed cooking. I didn't realize that there was a profession out there for that love or passion. And then when I was able to shadow a few chefs in Chicago, um, just fell in love with the activity, like the the colors of the plates, all the different kinds of food and like the learning. And then talking to these chefs, finding out that what made them get up every day was their love for what they do. It's really a passion. You know, people say when you love your job, it's not really a job. It doesn't feel like a job. So for me, that's how I feel about cooking. I feel like I know that this is something that I'm good at, that I can do, and I'm confident in doing it. So to apply that in your everyday life is, you know, one of the the joys of being a chef. To keep learning about chefs, Read through the information below.